Hi y'all, get the Sass TV. My name is Belen Bess and this is the Love Makeover Reading. This is for Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, Virgo, Libra, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius, and Pisces. This is your Love Makeover. Let's oh, see, I cut this out, but this is what I need. I forget her. So Aries, when it comes to love for you, what type of makeover, what type of changes that's going to be no, no, no. no. I'll cut it off. What type of changes that's going to be coming in for you that could uh, help you? Hold on. Then I got to go to bed. I got to get up right now. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I suppose I had this done a long time ago. Yeah, I know I'm always on, always on the late bus. Sorry about that. I got to keep up with them some kind of way. I don't do these no more. So, Aries, this is what's coming in for you when it comes down to your uh, love makeover. The changes that you can bring in, what you can do to bring things a little bit better for you if you need that makeover. This is a one-time thing. I'm never doing this again. So, Aries, it says that I don't really see love in your courts. I see where you're just really sitting around. You're laying around. You're you're enjoying yourself, probably pulling on your meat. I don't know what you're doing, but mon money's on your mind right now. I think when it comes down to love relationships, some of you, Aries, are feeling like it's over for you or you just want to keep that. You want to stay in the position that you're in. You don't want anything to move, kind of move too forward right now. You're going to put love to the back burner for you so the thing the advice for the love makeover for you is for you to open up more at this time are you aries taurus when it comes down to some type of love relationships i feel like you're getting on the same page and if you're back with any partners and you're expecting any income loans checks payday loans whatever's gonna get to the car loan somebody has got their eye on the dollar they are watching you. It's almost like this individual is waiting around for you to get the money. And they're hanging around just because they know that you are expecting some type of funds. So when it comes down to love, keep your cat, cat eye open. Keep, cat eye open. <laughs> keep that bitch wide. <laughs> just talking so fast makes me start. So as Jim and I, Jim, when it comes to love makeover, you need to be ending some of your negative uh, thoughts uh, when it comes down to your love relationship. Some of those negative thoughts comes with when you first meet some of uh, the initiation of relationships, uh, Gemini. When it comes down to love makeovers, you want to watch the initial meeting of partners and I think that's where you're going to get into those almost codependency some of you Gemini's, not all of you it's just a few. You just may see you may learn a lot about the beginning of your relationships at this time, okay? Cancer, 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 cancer cancer the card just talking about leaving some things behind when it comes down to your love life you know you can't just need a full makeover because i feel like right here that you've been dealing with two people and you had to make a decision and one some of y'all went back to your mother and baby daddy ain't nothing wrong with that but i feel like you only went back because of the child and at the same time it, it doesn't look bad it just doesn't look bad it just look like you regret doing it like they ain't who you want to be with but you got to make it work out and any makeover the makeover that you have for this time if you haven't made that decision go with your heart Go with your heart. Even though situations are what they are, go with your heart at this time. Cancer, Leo. Leo, Leo, Leo. You getting on the same page with somebody. You about to oh, get on the same page with somebody because you have been thinking about it for a while now. So, uh, the, the love echo for you is just to go ahead and move forward on these partners that you would like to see yourself with in relationships. I see it here. I see you kind of timid. And I see you being a little really. Crack that well. You know, all of that right there. But when it comes down to changes and new beginnings, this love relationship, okay? Virgo, 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 Virgo. At this time, you're going back to someone. If you've been separated from a partner, if you guys have been separated because of love, I mean, excuse me, because of work or where I get love from. You've been separated from trouble from work or uh, you maybe had to take care of a parent. Something had you and someone else separated. They about to pop up like it ain't shit. They about to pop up like it ain't shit. Uh, and the, the advice, so the love makeover for you, the advice for that is just ride them. Just ride them. <laughs> just ride them. Okay. Libra, Libra, Libra. 
Libra, this is what's going on for you when it comes down to your love relationships. Well, uh, and also too with you, Libra, uh, appearances and when you first meeting people, working on those initial uh, executions of relationships. Are you coming out flirtatious? Are you coming out more than what you need to be at the first two or three months of relationships? Are you giving too much in relationships? That's what's going to be coming. I guess she slicked it smooth. But anyway, so... Uh, this is what's going on for you. Some of you are worried about your responsibilities. There's something that's going to become right now. Love is making its way in. But I just see something being celebrated in front of you. And you're just so focused on income. You're so focused on your responsibilities. That maybe you won't be able to enjoy something. But I see a partnership here coming for you. Your love makeover, your love makeover is make up your mind, girl. Just make up your mind. Okay, Scorpio, 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 this is what's going on for you, Scorpio, and when it comes down to relationships for you, Scorpio, you are, um, you're meeting several people, you're meeting some people of your same age, you're, meet, you're meeting some people that are different ages of you, but I do see some type of changes coming, that you're either going to flip the age, flip the sex, flip the pet, flip, flip the pancakes, I don't know what you're going to do, but you're going to be just a flipping, okay, so that's what's going to be going on with that, you're going to be flipping bottles, baby. Do what you got them. But I, I, I do see that you are aware of the things that are going on in your love life. Okay? Just trying to make some decisions. You do what you want to do. That ain't none of my business. Uh, Scorpio, Sagittarius. Sagittarius, you have at least three partners around. And I think it's gotten down to two. Some of you Sagittarius, you, you've met someone that has opened your heart. You've met someone that has opened you up. And I feel like you want to speak to them again. I feel like you want to be around them. If not, you have just met someone that's seen one way and they're another way. You need to make your decisions on whether you want to move forward on a relationship or move forward in your love life with someone new. I, it looks like you like them. Okay, and the love makeover is speak up, you know, just go ahead and speak up in the relationship. If you like them, tell them. If you don't like them, be gone. But I see that you're longing something that uh, you, you're going to have to make a quick decision about and quick a decision is maybe whether to stay or whether to go. Capricorn, 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 what Capricorn? Some of you Capricorns are traveling back to a party that you've been with within 2016 and 2017, 2017. 18 you've been with this person back and forth and forth and back with this relationship is gonna take its last stand it's coming in babies i got the power and it's over that is what's going on here i do see that the love has been some type of push and pull and toss and turn and up and down and back and grind and grinding and gr all of that's going on but this relationship is going to come back to the same partner that's what it says you're going to be going to the same partner aquarius Aquarius, Aquarius. Now, with your love life, you know, I don't see love for you, baby. I don't see love for you. I see double the moolah. That's what's going on for you. Whatever you be, I'm just going to go and keep it real with you. Whatever you, now, now, if you're into prostitution and paying tricks and doing all that, I ain't got no problem in. The check has cleared. You will be getting that coochie this week, okay? Because it's took for double the money, girl. I'm just saying, you know, call girls make a lot of money. They got to get that bread, too. You know, they got to do what they got to do. So, if you don't, if you don't have sent the invoice over, it has, it's being paid. Because there's double the money coming in with you. I feel like you've been bringing some things in. You've been thinking about, this is what I want to do. Or you've been planning some type of business technique and starting to pay off for it. You're going to see that money come in real soon. I don't see no more love for you. Now, Pisces, you will be going back to it as somebody that you ended things with. You will be thinking it. You're going to think that maybe you was too harsh or you was too mean. Or you wouldn't go back and talk to them because of the ending. And then again, somebody could be waiting to hear from you because uh, you ended things with them. So if you don't want to call JoJo the Bobo back because you ain't, he on your nerd, <laughs> fired, you don't have to call him back. Um, if you feel like you hurt somebody's feelings, true to heart, just kind of say, look, um, whatever, y'all know it's ended, but I didn't mean to come off harsh, and I'm not apologizing for what I said at that time, because it came out that way, but if I hurt your feelings, I do apologize, and it's still over fire of the night. Hi, you welcome to Sass TV. My name's Belen Bass, and this is another reality, uh, love makeover video, and I just did this for fun. I'm just doing fun things just to help some of my subscribers that are left over. If you get a chance to look in this box, it's somewhere around here. I think it's right there, because Look, click on that box and you can see how I work. God bless you. And I cannot wait to see the new year. Bye.